Um, I'm a designer and an engineer from South Africa. Uh, I make artworks and this is my first time that I've been able to experiment with fashion. And it's been wonderful because I've been using the Conex 3 from Stratasys and they've got multi-material and multi-color. And I believe that this is the first time that I'm using a technology that truly allows me to make something that is as close to an end product as it probably can be at this stage in the technology. And at some stage I had a fascination with the Garden of Eden and of Eve and the apple and, and things like that. And, and so part of the inspiration, for example, for the, um, the serpent shoes is what if uh, the roles were changed and instead Eve was, you know, said to uh, the serpent, no, I'm in charge. <laughs> yeah, no, and all this, you know, subjugation of women didn't help happen. No, she's a full-on woman. She's got her corset and this is a stained glass corset. <laughs> and it's got uh, rigid clear and tango black and then magenta in it. And as you can see, so it's, it's three three um, materials that gets mixed together. It's it's quite rubbery actually. And these are these are see-through panels. Um, and it's actually made to custom fit from body scan data. So I work with Euphormia as well. So this corset can fit anybody and not by scaling up or down, but by literally fitting their body type. So I think that was fascinating, the way that 3D printing goes and it adapts itself to custom fit and to personalization. Now what is fascinating about this Conix um, 3D printer is that um, you can combine flexible parts um, with a rubbery feel with, with hard parts and as well um, use different colors. And I think that was the fascinating part of this project is having to completely rethink how you make things. And this machine with the colors and with the rigid and the softness, it's, it's like breaking through a boundary. It's like entering a whole new space of, of prototyping and of creating.